this video will be looking at adding a master peg bar to your drawings. Now we can see in the node view that the control drawing and the hand drawing both have peg bars attached to them, but without a master peg bar, moving them around together simultaneously would be really annoying. You'd have to select both keys, select the transform tool, and then make sure to move them around together every single time. So instead of doing that, we'll add a master peg bar, which will affect both drawings. So let's start by clicking the control peg in the node view. Over here, we'll select the icon to add a peg. Click and drag a new connection to the hand peg. And now we have a peg bar that moves the control and the hand together at the same time. Let's rename that peg bar by clicking the uh, little yellow square right here. And we'll get the layers property a view where we can change out the name. I'm going to rename it control hand master P so it's uh, easily labeled. And if you select the transform tool over here in the tools toolbar, you'll see that with this peg bar, you can now move the entirety of your drawings that are attached to it all together in one shot. Over here in the timeline, you can see that because I moved things around with the master peg, that Harmony is adding keyframes to that peg bar and not the, the peg bars below it over here. So if you want to move everything around together, you would add keyframes. You'd have to make sure that this is highlighted, the master peg bar, and that all your keyframes are going into this master peg bar timeline.